let Garmin show you some tips to successfully connect your Garmin automotive device to a computer. This will be important if you need to update the maps or software on your Garmin device using Garmin Express. Keep in mind, many work or company computers won't allow you to connect external devices. We do recommend using a home computer for this process. First, we will plug in your Garmin automotive device into the computer. Take the big end of the Garmin USB cable and plug it directly into the USB port on the computer. We want to ensure we are not using a hub or any USB ports on a monitor. Many hubs only transfer power instead of power and data, which is necessary for this process. We do want to plug your Garmin device directly into the computer. Next, take the small end of the cable and plug it into the port directly on your Garmin device. Again, we want to ensure we are using the Garmin cable that came with your device. Some USB cables will only charge your device. The Garmin USB cable will transfer power and data. We do not want to use any ports that may be on the device's mount. These are only for use in your vehicle and not for updating your device. Many Garmin automotive devices will display a picture to note that your device is successfully connected. You can also check to see if the battery icon displays a lightning bolt. Either will indicate your device is receiving power from your computer. Select Yes or Continue if your device displays a message asking if you want to enter file transfer mode. You may also have the option to select Connect to Computer first. Your computer should recognize your Garmin device after a short period of time. If your device is not recognized, try a different USB port on your computer. Preferably a USB port on the back of a desktop computer or any other USB port on a laptop. Once you plug it into the next USB port, allow 60 seconds for your computer to recognize your device. We can also ensure the USB cable's connection is secure. A loose connection to the computer or on your device can indicate a loose or damaged port. Next, we need to ensure your device has some battery charge. If your device's display does not turn on at all or only shows a battery icon when connected to a computer, we will want to let it sit for about 15 minutes to receive a charge. If the device has not powered on after 15 minutes, hold the power button for 30 seconds. This will turn on your device. If your computer still doesn't recognize your device, we do want to try a different USB data transfer cable. Lastly, restart your computer. A different computer may be necessary if your computer still doesn't recognize your device. And that's it. For more help, visit support.garmin.com. Thanks for watching.